What is up? My name is Garrett at Yogurt on Twitter, Y-O-O-G-R-R-T-T. -T. Thank you so much for tuning into the Now in Station YouTube channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is the Little Mosey North's Best Mixtape Album Review. No, it's definitely an album, but it shares the same name as his original mixtape from 2017, and it's convoluted with tracks from... Uh, from from single droppings and and various Cole Bennett music videos and uh, yeah I I just I just think this the <laughs> I want to I want to keep this as short as sweet as possible because I, I just feel like this is a good example of what you're not gonna gonna want to do if you're coming out with like a debut album uh, you don't want to call it the same name as your original mixtape you don't want it to to kind of feel like a mixtape you don't want it to to have seven tracks that are new and only two really stand out um, and then kind of just pluck her in like the good ones that people have hyped you up for and get excited for this very album because of um, and then just kind of like hope that that extends out the longevity of this album and uh, you know pulls the sales through as well on the record label side but um, yeah yeah this this is not this is not my cup of tea necessarily. It's not not that it's it's not it's not Little Mosey. You know, I enjoy him when he shines at his best. I, I really do, um, but I just don't think that this like had much weight to it at all. I, I feel like it was very very just like slapped together in some cases. Uh, it was announced only a few days before it came out, but he had been ambiguously talking about an album for a minute, so I I wasn't really caught by surprise. It just seemed like. Uh, they're just like, yeah, go for it, whatever, like get the shit out of the way so we can get you hopefully moving on to other stuff. Um, at least that's what I'm, I'm saying pessimistically from my, 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 my high horse, because, uh, I'm just not enjoying this thing. So no offense to anyone who really does enjoy this album. I just did not feel like it came across as like a project that I'm going to remember. And it's definitely not like a great debut for, for someone coming out right now. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, let's get into track number um, one, which is Kamikaze, track number two, uh, we got Foo Shit, track number three is Notice, track number four is Rari, track number five is Pull Up, track number six is Burberry Headband, track number seven is Greet Her, track number eight is That's My Bitch, track number nine is Yappa featuring Blockboy JB, track number ten is Boot Pack, and track number eleven is Trap Star, and kind of to just get into more of what I mean, like, we had Noticed, we had Boot Pack, we had, uh, fucking Yappa, and we had Pull Up, and those all already existed. Those were those are songs that 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 were out. Um, fine, you know what I mean. But again, if you're only teasing in a few days before your album, it's not even really coming across like it's a like a single for an album. You know what I mean? Like you are hyping it up, but there was nothing announced. So it's not like oh yeah, this 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 Blockboy JB track that just kind of dropped pretty recent. Um, you know, like that's a song that that probably will be on this album like i'm excited like i didn't feel that way i just felt like it was another little mosey track and then this fucking thing comes out and it's just like i don't know it's just whatever it is but it it, it really isn't it, it never blew my mind um the only two standout tracks not counting the f the four singles that i just named um there may even be another single in there i don't know but uh uh, Kamikaze I'm enjoying and Rari I'm, I'm enjoying uh, Kamikaze I'm like half enjoying some sometimes I do so I, I like it with the Cole Bennett video that's 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 a good visual for the tone of what what is being portrayed in the actual song so shout out to Cole for doing that like he always does but yeah I'm just just not enjoying this thing as much as I wanted to I don't think that this is really how you should come out with a debut album I feel like you got to come with your your guns a blazing you got to really refine your craft and I feel like only Rari and Kamikaze further the crap but it doesn't really like do anything different it's not better than noticed i don't think in the long run or else i think those would have been out before although rari's fun and it actually comes right after noticed and those play really well as far as transitionally and i like there's a lot to enjoy with him it's just not that this album really like is needed for you to do that like and that's kind of a problem like the album should be the vehicle for for me to really like believe in the career and the artistry and the craft but like if you're not going to be pushing like a full fucking catalog of music in a fucking way that's actually going to like progress an idea or a concept or even like show the growth within like your artistry that's going to get lost unless like you can you can kind of come through with like a really tidy project and this is just wasn't that for me um but i'm not saying that he's not a good artist doesn't have hot bangers uh i, I do enjoy a few tracks on here uh, the various videos such as uh noticed 
pull up, like I said. Um, Rari's going to be in my rotation for a minute, and so is Kamikaze. So there, there is stuff to enjoy on here. It's just not, not a project that I'm going to be like touting from the hills. Is like, yeah, this is the catalog of Little Mosey music that that you need to you need to fall in love with because it's not. So yeah, what is your favorite track? Let me know in the comment section below. My name is Gary Yoker on Twitter Y O O G R R T T. Thank you so much for tuning into this review. Uh, again, let me know what your favorite tracks are. Sorry if I shit on your favorite album of the year. That's the beauty of music is we can agree to disagree. And uh, yeah, that is all, folks.